afternoon folks big Bo here with another great class a motorhome value from parkway rv center and folks today we got in well it's one of my personal favorite brands uh we've got in a 2003 tiffin allegro bay this is the model number 36 db two slide outs only 25,000 miles Nice motorhome, folks. Very high quality, built on a workhorse heavy-duty chassis. Got the 8100 Vortec V8, the Allison transmission. Um, got the big wheels and tires, just like a diesel motorhome has. I mean, this is. these are nice rigs, folks, for this price range. Uh, two slide outs, of course, Tiffin. Uh, great company. One of the few Southern RV manufacturers. Uh, they are built in Red Bay, Alabama by the Tiffin family. Bob Tiffin, of course, one of the pioneers of the RV industry, and his sons and grandchildren still run the factory today. In fact, you can still see, even though they're executives in the company, you still see them on the factory floor working the line. I mean, just a really hard-working family. They build a great product. They intentionally limit themselves to six motorhomes per day. Where other brands do 25 or 30, they do six motor homes and they've done it like that for years folks the reason why they want to control the quality of each and every product that leads their that leaves their factory floor so you're not going to see as many tiffins or allegros as you do like fleetwoods and four winds coachman's and all the other brands folks because like i said they intentionally limit themselves on how many they build per day and that's why you still you still see people using Allegros from the early and late 70s that are still on the road today. I mean, they just build a great unit, very high quality. This unit new in 2003, not 2017, 17s are a lot more now. 2003, this unit stickered for $112,000. It's got 25,000 miles, and here it is for $39,900 with a complete inspection by our certified RV techs. No delamination. These things don't delaminate like cheaper brands do. 50 amp service. It's got a, a oversized 7KW Onan generator with 250 hours. They have 250 hours on it, folks. Sorry about that. Got a frog in my throat. Uh, I do have the bra for it. It's got the. It's inside one of the bays, but it's got the snaps for the bra. Glass looks great. Got the driver's side door. Uh, hydraulic leveling jacks, both slide outs. I mean, this unit just came in, folks. Keep in mind, it is 14 years old. That's why it's $39,900 and not $80,000 more or $70,000 more like a brand new one is. $73,000 more. So you're saving $73,000 right off the bat buying used over new. Now, folks, I'm not going to say it's brand new. For those of you who watch my videos, you know I'm very clear that we sell used RVs, not new ones. Now, if you look at 100 2003 Allegros, this is probably going to be in the top five as far as condition, but it's not going to be new, folks. If you search this thing, you're going to find imperfections. That's just part of buying a 14-year-old motorhome. Now, folks, what we do after purchase is we go through a major systems check on this motorhome. We're going to make sure it functions and operates like it's supposed to. Now, the cosmetic stuff, folks, that's 14 years old. You may have a little uh, faded spot on the paint or a crack in the stripe or a scratch or a ding or a dent or a worn spot. That's part of buying a 14-year-old motorhome, and that's what that's the price you have to pay to save that $72,000 over what this thing costs you, and, and don't even think that you can go and buy a new 2017 Allegro now for what you could have bought this 2003 for new because they're about 30 grand higher now. Let's look inside. Now folks, this one just came in, so you're looking at it just how we got it. Power step works great. As we step inside here, now folks, the lights are a little bit dim. Um, we're gonna have to replace the batteries on this coach. It's got 2012 batteries, so obviously they're not holding a charge, so I'm going to put new batteries in it. So they're going to be a little bit dim, but up here in the front, the dash air works. It's got a, a backup camera system that works, HWH, 25,167 miles, which for that 340 horse V8 is not even broken in yet. 
You know, the Vortec in 2003 was the most powerful gas engine on the market at 340 horsepower compared to the Ford's 305 or the 310 horsepower they offered in the V10. Plus, you've got the Allison transmission. You've got the heavy-duty wheels and tires. This has got a wider wheelbase than the Ford, so it doesn't sway like a Ford does. And, uh, you know, it's a great rig. Inside, folks, you got real ceramic tile floor. You got real Corian countertops. You got leather flex steel furniture. Both front seats swivel around for party seating. Uh, you've got two ducted, ice cold ducted roof airs. You got the upgrade side by side uh, refrigerator freezer with built in ice maker. It's got a central vacuum system. It's got a convection oven, microwave combination, and a stove top. Got the padded headliner so it helps you help insulate the RV. Plus, it, you know, it also helps you detect leaks. You ever seen an old car that the headliner's sagging in? Well, these padded headliners do the same thing. If they ever get too hot or too or water in it from a leak, they're going to sag down. And, folks, you see no sagging in this headliner whatsoever. Uh, so Sleeper sofa and table booth both make, both make beds with plenty of room for air mattresses and pallets in between. So if you've got a couple of extra people in here, you can still sleep them. Uh, got the bevel glass out behind the on the wall right there as we step through here this unit does have washer and dryer hookups and you can add one for fifteen hundred dollars of course my for those of you who watch my videos you know I'm not a big fan of them as is most people who are around RVs a lot of service a lot of headaches the only way I could see justifying a washer and dryer in an RV is if you're going to full time and live in it and use it once a week. Other than that, folks, trust me, take my advice and stay away from them. But anyway, uh, here in the, you got a really nice back bedroom. Again, I apologize, the lights are a little dim. Well, my RV techs are gonna put some new batteries in this uh, when we check it out and all that stuff. So those lights will be bright, won't be any problems there. Um, big closet across the back, you got a TV. Like I said, two ducted roof airs, that seven KW generator has got more than enough power to pull both those air conditioners and then some you know most of the most of the two air units have 5,000 watt 5,500 watt generators but like I said Allegro concentrates on quality not quantity so that oversized generator is just one of the many things they do to overbuild their RVs skylight looks great <coughs> got a nice tub in here which is about as close to a house size tub as you're going to find in a Class A motorhome. It's going to be a little smaller, but small adults or kids will, will love that. Porcelain RV toilet, big medicine cabinet, vent fans. Like I said, it's a real ceramic tile floor. We got the original carpet in here. Only 25,000 miles, and it's only got 250 hours on the generator. And, and that, that's a dead sign, folks. I know a lot of people see low miles on one to think it's been a live in unit, but. The live-in units have, may have 25,000 miles on them and 1,200 hours on the generator. This has got 250, and it doesn't show any live-in wear and tear. I mean, everything in here just looks pretty much normal or above normal condition for a 14-year-old motorhome, and definitely a bargain for the price, folks. It's going to include a, a full checkout by my certified RV techs. That includes, but not limited to, the jack system, the running, the driving, it's going to include generator. We're going to make sure all that works. Your air conditioners are cold. Refrigerator's cold. We're going to make sure all your plumbing works, all your electrical works, all your outlets work, all your lights work, all your cabinets work, all your charging system works. Uh, we're going to make sure no plumbing leaks, no propane leaks. We're going to make sure all your appliances work. We're going to make sure the refrigerator works on gas and electric. We're going to make sure your microwave confection oven works, your stove top, water heater, furnace, all that stuff, folks. Like I said, we, do, and we cover all your vent fans. If any of that stuff doesn't work, of course, folks, we fix it. No matter what it costs before you pick this unit up or before we deliver it. Now, keep in mind, folks, to keep our overhead down, which in turn keeps our prices down, we do not check these units until they're sold. So please don't come in here expecting to pick it up the same day you pay for it. What we do after purchase, this goes in the line in the back. And I don't know when you're watching this video, so I don't know what the current status is or how many units are in front of it when you purchase it. So what you want to do before you buy this RV on eBay or Craigslist or the 20 plus other different websites we advertise on, call ahead, talk to my non-commissioned salespeople and they will uh, tell you the current lead time for a 
pre-owned Class A checkout. And, of course, they will be more than happy to send you over a copy of our checkout list and what we check out for the price that you pay for the unit. You're going to be very surprised how extensive it is. So it's way more extensive than most other RV dealers check out a used RV. Or you may, uh, you may be a fixer, you know, you may want to take a chance and buy it as is. We'll give you a discount price if you want to take it as is without the inspection. And, uh, of course, now when you buy one as is, folks, I mean, you take the good with the bad, no walkthrough, you get no demonstration. You just jump in it and go. And we'll be happy to discount the price, whatever that costs us for the inspection, uh, or roughly what it would cost us, we'll discount this unit for that price. Either way you go, folks, if you want it checked out, ready to go, the price, like everything else, is haggle-free. Uh, there's no extra fees. There's no surprises. There's no games. There's no gimmicks. We've been doing this for 49 years. We're one of the oldest, largest, and most successful independently owned RV dealers in the United States today. We've got over 170-plus used RVs in stock, lowest prices on the Internet, and we sell five to 600 used RVs a year. And, folks, I'm going to tell you like I tell everybody else. I tell you everything up front because, uh, like, as far as it being used, and we don't cover cosmetics, and and I've had to emphasize this to a few customers. But but when you sell five to six hundred used RVs a year, and I'm not trying to mean this in a negative way, that's a good thing. We don't have we've got four salespeople, and they don't have the time uh, to deal with drama, with with trouble, with gimmicks, surprises, or anything like that any more than you do. So. You know, these things are used. They're not new. They're not ready to go until we sell them. Unless you want to take it as is. We just drill, driven this motor home from North Carolina. So it was a North Carolina motor home. We drove it in five, 400 miles or so. It did great. Um, like I said, we are going to put new batteries in it. So we'll check the charging system and all that when we do that as well. But the batteries were five years old. So. Anybody who's had motorhomes will tell you five years is a long time to get out of house batteries. But this unit is thirty nine nine while it lasts. Um, twenty five thousand miles comes with a full inspection, complete walkthrough and demonstration at the thirty nine nine price. You get a temp tag, you get starter kits, you get DVDs and and more, folks. All for thirty nine nine out the door. No surprises, no surprise fees when you get here, and. Um, you know, other dealers, they're going to hit you up with three or $4,000 in after-sales fees that they don't tell you about until you get ready to sign on the dotted line. We don't do that, folks. Uh, what we do is, like I said, you'll come pick it up, and it's thirty nine nine. And, of course, if you're a Georgia resident, since we are the oldest and largest independently unused RV dealership in the entire state of Georgia, uh, we have... To collect sales tax or TAVT tax. If you're a Georgia resident only, all out of state residents will pay your sales tax when you tag and title this motor home at your local DMV office in your home state. And you'll pay what your state sales tax rate is. Every state's got a different rate, just about. So, uh, best way to figure out your sales tax rate is just Google your zip code and put in your zip code's uh, sales tax rate, and that will definitely. Um, Tell you exactly what you're going to pay. But you get a 45 day temp tag, no extra charge. You get that full walkthrough, the inspection, all for $39.9. Give us a call, folks. Our phone numbers are 706 965 7929. Evenings and Sundays, you can get sales help at 423 605 6747. All this unit's also got a uh, King Dome satellite system on the roof, too. You know, those are those are two or three thousand dollars to add one of those. Uh, but anyway, folks, again, our phone number is 706-965-7929, evenings and Sundays, 423-605-6747. Our website's parkwayrvcenter.com or .net. Folks, we don't have commission salespeople. We don't have finance managers. We have financing available, uh, and you pay the lowest possible rate that we can get you approved for. I'm thinking around 4%. It's about the best rate you can hope for with 10% down on a luxury item like this. And we're more than happy to go work through your own bank or credit union as well. Uh, we can get you extended terms up to 144 months with approved credit. But anyway, folks, give us a call. Uh, this unit's not going to last long. Uh, email us, sales at parkwayrvcenter.com. If you have any particular questions you'd like to ask me personally, 
I don't take phone calls, folks. I'm on the lot doing videos all the time, so I do not take phone calls. You'll have to email me, Bo, B-O, at parkwayrvcenter.com, and I'll get back to you shortly with whatever answer, whatever questions you have, folks. I've, I've been around these things personally for over 20 years. I buy and sell more RVs in a single day, folks, than many of you will in, in your entire lifetime, and I've got a lot of experience. We've been here 49 years as a business and whole, and I'm the third generation here, so... Uh, give us a call, drop us an email. Uh, you can send general sales questions to sales at parkwayrvcenter.com. Now, I don't sell these directly anymore, folks, but you can email me direct with questions, comments, or anything else at bo, B -O at parkwayrvcenter.com. And you can call our sales department at 706-965-7929. Evenings and Sundays, you can get sales help at 423 425-6747. Like I said, folks, you can buy with confidence. We're one of the largest, oldest, and most successful independently owned used RV dealerships in business today. Over 40, almost 50 years in business, folks. There's not much we haven't seen in the past 50 years. So put our experience to work for you. Plus, you get the savings, too, because our prices are lower because we've been in business so long, we don't owe nobody a thing. These other dealers that have $10 million piece of property that they got it mortgaged to the neck, and have to go finance RVs just to be able to buy them and that, that sponsor NASCAR and spend millions and millions of dollars a year in advertising and have hundreds of employees working for them. You don't want to buy from those places, folks, because all that extra expensive means extra overhead. The higher the overhead, the higher the prices. It's simple math. When you get to a dealer that, that only spends maybe a grand on every unit they sell, in overhead, well, you can buy that unit a lot cheaper than a dealer that has $10,000 in every unit they sell in overhead. That's, so, you know, we can save you some money. No surprises, no games, no gimmicks. We're very straightforward and more. So give us a call. Drop us an email. Look forward to seeing you here in beautiful Ringgold, Georgia.